Keep your eyes closed and pray after me. Lord Jesus, open my heart. Speak to me today. And change my life forever. Forever. And everybody says, Amen. My name is Bill Clark. And I'm Janice Clark. And we are co-founders of Knoxville Inner City Kids Outreach, KIKO. We're a nonprofit parachurch ministry. Our mission is to equip and empower Knoxville's inner city kids to realize their full potential and discover their God-given destiny. We like to say that uh, we're mobilizing the message of hope to a generation, changing the inner city one child at a time. Yeah, the ministry started in 1995 by doing Christmas outreach at a Boys and Girls Club in East Knoxville, Walter P. Taylor Homes. It was a ministry that was started by our family, and we were just hoping that uh, we would get an invitation back, that they would like what we did, and sure enough, they did. Well, I'm Rob Ellis. And I'm Chris Ellis. And we work with Kiko doing Sunday school at seven different sites in Knoxville, Tennessee. We have six kids of our own that we bring along with us. We consider this a family ministry. We minister together as a family in each of the sites. At some of the sites we do uh, pre-service activities where we color with the kids, do sidewalk chalk, we have hula hoop contests. It's just been a neat way to um, be more one-on-one -on -one with the children. The reason that we do what we do uh, we started seeing as we, as we went in obedience, we began to see incredible needs. Children living in single parent families, growing up in poverty, uh, surrounded by gangs, drugs, violence, just real recipe for disaster in their lives. And uh, God began to expand our vision of how His Word would change their, their world and their life. And so uh, we, we followed that. And, as we have done that, the vision has gotten even larger. My name is Dominic Amai, and I'm nine. The things that I like about Sunday school is the lessons, the games, the songs. When everything we're supposed to be to follow God's track. My name is Ani. I'm eight years old. I've been coming to Sunday school four years. My favorite thing is sing about God at Sunday school. We're learning about self-control that you can use in many different ways. Hi, my name is Michael Clark, son of Bill and Janice Clark, and I work, currently I work with the youth. Our youth program, the junior staff, began in 2003 as we began to see a need uh, that some of the, the younger children that had grown up with us were outgrowing our program because if a three and four year old can understand our Sunday school lessons, then once they get to about 12 or 13, they start to outgrow what we're doing and become too cool for Sunday school. So we started what we call the junior staff, where they actually take on ownership of their individual site where they grew up, sitting on the tarp as a boy or a girl, and they kind of become the mentors to their younger peers. The landscape of Knoxville's inner city has changed dramatically since 17 years ago when Kiko first began. We've seen rows of apartments demolished, families displaced to other areas of our city, but we don't serve a location, we minister to people. And we look for new opportunities and ways to find where, where are the people at, where are these children and their families, so we can continue to minister to them. And so now in the 11 different locations where we have Sunday school, we're looking for churches that can partner with us because while we minister to children and their families, the children have always been a gateway, a door to reaching the families and their communities. But it takes an army to truly see a village transformed. So we're always looking for churches that will partner with us to adopt communities, to invest in those areas uh, on days when Sunday school isn't going on, to needs that Sunday school doesn't specifically meet, holistically reaching these communities. There are ways for businesses, for individuals to support, to get involved, to pray for us, and we're always looking for those that would connect with our vision and our heart to reach Knoxville's inner city.